Good afternoon, everybody. This is North Camp Pepper. Um, <clears throat> I remember wanted to reset up an aquarium for a long time, and I got one, my old one, out of storage. That was a, uh, you know, in pretty bad shape. Um, so the wife talked me into getting rid of it, and uh, went out today and spent, you know, it's about a hundred bucks, I guess, for the basic kit here. But these are glowfish, and I don't know how new this is, but it's kind of new to me. So. I thought I'd try it, and I guess these, these fish, uh, I'm going to set this up first, and I'll probably set up another channel that's going to stream it live off the Raspberry Pi. But, you know, I need to reduce some stress around here, um, just to be happier and just more tranquil. I've always liked aquariums anyway, and give the dog something to look at when we're not here. But, so I'm going to set this up, so I'll let you guys know what's going on, and we'll get a stream going, and not going to do an unboxing because there's there's a lot of those out there already. I looked up a few of them, but we're going to set this up. We're going to get um, probably going to get some live plants later down the line once I figure out what I'm doing. Got to figure out how many fish I can buy, and I got to run this thing for at least 24 hours if I use spring water. They said uh, we didn't do that back in the day, but like I said, since I'm dealing with GMOs here or genetically modified organisms as fish, now I think from what I've you know couple minute research on the web they are basically just tetras and betas and they they just had another gene added to the uh, make them uh, um, fluorescent so we'll get this set up and then tomorrow I'll do a video or the next day I'll do a video on it <clears throat> with it set up and some fish in there after I get them in the acclimate um, I'm gonna try to get these and get a cosmos and I don't know we'll figure it out and uh, Watch out, nosy dog. So that's just what's going on right now. I'm going to set this up. I know a lot of people are going to be upset that they're genetically modified, but they already do it, did it, and I didn't do it. So I like the way they look, so that's what I'm going to do. And I got some coral here that's fake. It's uh, got a bubble thing. But all together, this whole thing cost about about a hundred bucks. Um, you know, you're, you're paying for convenience there, and I just wanted to pay for it and be done. But let me get this set up here, and I'll be back in a day or two once I get it and get some fish. And I think I'm going to get a snail in there. I used to have a snail in my other aquarium. I like that a lot. But we'll see. I saw some different Pocosmos or algae eaters, and I'm going to get probably one of those. And they have ones with stick or something. A stick Picasso, or a stick, I don't know, a stick algae eater. It looks like a twig. I kind of like the way that fish looked too, so I'm going to get that. And like I said, it would be nice. And like I said, I'll, I'll set up a channel. And I'll use one of the Raspberry Pis to live stream it uh, to, to the YouTube channel. But I'll set that up when time comes. But that's what's up right here. I thought that's kind of neat. I think the glowfish look pretty cool. Um, I don't know. You know, Depending on if you're okay with genetic modification or not. I don't think it's personally right, but it is what it is. Um, I also don't believe in docking dogs' tails or ears because I don't think something should be modified because it looks pretty. But that's kind of exactly what we're doing here. And I don't know. I have mixed emotions on it, but morality aside, they do look cool. So, and the, and the deed has already been done. I wouldn't eat them, but still. So there you go. It's also 10 gallons of water storage that we'll have around. And, you know, we can we can use the ultraviolet thing on there, too, and purify the water now and then and sterilize and sanitize it with UV. So there you go. Um, I'll do another video in a few days once I get everything set up. But y'all, please rate, subscribe, and have a great day. Um, yeah, just have a great day, everybody. Um, you know, maybe we could do a contest on what color fish or naming the fish. Um... So tell me what colors you want. I kind of like the green ones back there. Um, we'll see. I'm going to get all colors, but if we want, we can name them for your channel. So let's get some names for some fishes going down here. We'll figure out what we're going to call them. Um, yeah. All right. So have a great day, everybody. Let's get pepper out.